Hi everyone, welcome to the New York Times Hard Sudoku on this very hot Monday, February 26th, 2024. It's about 95 degrees or 35 in Celsius here in North Texas. So what better way to do that than be inside and solve a puzzle? So in my normal scanning, I like to go by the top three rows and the middle three rows, the bottom three rows, and then the left three, the middle three, and the right three columns respectively. Now in the top three rows, let's start again. I've only got two nines, so I can place a nine, and that's it. In the middle three rows, I've got a one that I can actually place. This one and this one force a one down here, but this is ruled out because that one looks down. Okay, so one is placed. Five is going to be in those two. And that's all we get, I believe. If one and five are out, I've got two, five, eight, seven, nine, three, four. Okay, then six, eight, two, nine. So four is here and here. So one of these two, but not there. So four is placed in box nine based on the bottom three rows, and that's all I'm going to get. So looking at the leftmost three columns, nine, they gave me all three of them. One, those two, we'll force the one down there. I think. If one and nine are out, I've got seven, two, five, six, four, I'm done. Okay. What about the middle three rows? I can place an eight in one of those two. And I can place a four in one of these three based on the rightmost columns. But that's all I get now. Box five looks very interesting to me because that has five digits already placed. There are in fact three spots for nine, unfortunately. But I need two, four, six to go with that nine. Now, four can't go here or here. So four is one of those two. Six actually sees these three, so that's a six which means nine is now one of these two. And what that means is I now have four and nine marked in the same two cells in corners. That means that's a hidden four nine pair. And we know immediately that that's a two because it's the only digit left. Now, this two and this two, we're gonna force a two in one of those two. This six and this six along with that one force a six in one of those two. Not that that helps me a whole lot. Um, two, four, six, eight, nine. So I need one, three, five, and seven for column four. This sees one and seven. This is no longer nine. It's one, three, five, or seven. This is one, three, or seven. It can't be five, but that can be any of the odd digits. Um, row four also has a lot of digits in it. One, two, five, six, eight. I need three, four, seven, nine. Well, hmm. I need three, what, one, two, five, six, eight, right? I need three, four, eight and nine. No. One, two, five, six, eight. Says I need three, four, seven, nine, and this one does see three, four, and seven. Uh, four, seven, nine. That's a three, and it's hidden. So this three and those three are going to force a three in one of these. Um, okay, four can't go here. So again, well, guess what? That's a four. Uh, these are seven, nine as a pair. sure looks like 235 is limited to those cells. Yeah, because they can't go in here because 235 are ruled out of all these. So this is a 235 hidden triple, actually. Uh, 
these are 6, 8. And the box is done. This is a hidden 7 to fill out the row. So I've got 1, 5, 6, 7, 9 in column 2. I need 2, 3, 4, and 8. That sells any of them. That sells anything but 8. This sees 2 and 3. That is 4 or 8 explicitly. Oh, and this sees 2, 4, and 8. That's a 3. So little did we know that there's a triple. Okay, so this is going to be a triple. 4, 8, and something. 6. I'll mark this, I'll mark that. Okay. Uh, seven looks down into box seven. We can't go there. And so it must go one of these three. Let's see. I wish I had something better to do, but I'm going to have to do vertically for most of this. 4, 5, 6, 7 in column 6 says I need 1, 2, 3, 8, 9. Well, this sees 1 and 9. This sees everything but 9. This sees everything but 8. What did I say? 1, 2, 3, 8, 9? So this is 1 or 9. It sees the other digits. This is 1, 2, or 3 because it can't be 8. Hmm. Uh, that was not terribly helpful, I don't think. What about column three? I've got three, four, seven, nine. I need one, two, five, six, eight. Those can't be one, so we start with two, five, six, and eight, and then clean that up. This we've already done. What did I say? One, two, five. 6 and 8, this sees 5 and 6, oh, 6 is without both of these, 2 and 8 by box, okay, so 1's there, and as expected, I know nothing else useful, okay, these are going to be 1, 2, from, oh, 1, 2, 5, 7, and 8, except none of these can be 1 or 2, so this is a hidden 5, 7, 8, okay, I may as well get rid of those. But 5, 7, 8 are definitely in these three cells, and they're all in the same box. That can't be 5. That's a 1. This isn't 1 by placement or 8. That's a 2. Now, this is another triple. I've got all these triples interacting. Yeah, here's one, here's one. What are these? They, these are not 1, 2, 7, or 9. Uh, 3's there, as expected. 2's there, as expected. Now, 5, 7, 8 in here means those, this can't be 8 because 8's in the column already. This, these are not 5, and this isn't 8. So guess what? That's another triple. So if you take a look here, you can see I've got green, purple, orange, red, yellow, and blue. I have six different triples marked in this grid. And what looks like 1, 2, 3, 4 of them interact in box 4. What that means is once I find the break-in, the puzzle's going to collapse relatively quickly, but... Well, actually, that 1 makes this a 9. So this isn't 9, that is. Okay, so these are 1, 2, 3, and 8. Let's see. One, three, eight, nine in column five.
be well, neither of those can be six, and this can't be seven. Okay, these are not one, three, four, eight, or nine. Right? Because they see one, three, eight, nine by column four by box. So two, five, six, and seven are left, and this sees two, five, and six. That is a seven. So this cell isn't. And therefore, these are not seven. And those aren't seven, and that's not two. Because it sees it in the row. Seven is going to make this eight. So this resolves down to a five, seven pair. Okay, eight there, eight there, puts an eight down here, but not in the center of box nine. It's not going to help me much, though. Five, seven, five, six. This is five, six, seven, but not five. Okay, so that's a triple. Hmm. Actually, I think I can use those highlights going forward. I'm going to do that. Um, ah, I don't have much of anything in the top third of the grid, do I? But three five one three one three five, yeah, that's a seven. Okay, that doesn't help me with a whole lot. Other than tell me here's a triple. I've got two more colors I can use. Down there, uh let's see. Four is here. Three is there. That doesn't help me with anything, but one is there. It doesn't really help me with anything either. What about row seven? I've only got two things left. One, three, and something. Nine. Amazingly, none of which is resolved yet. How many triples do I have? What are the first six, seven, eight, nine? I felt like 10. Yeah, I have 9 plus 1 is 10, minus this one. I have 9 triples marked at the moment. And I am absolutely nowhere with this top corner of the grid. I want to be, but I'm not. All right, what's down here? These aren't two, four, five, or nine. That's not eight, that's not one, but I have nothing useful there. Other than nine's on one of these two, but we knew that already. Okay, these are not seven, eight, or nine. Okay, these cells are not 6, 8, or 9. These are not 1, 7, 8, or 9. So they're from 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 only. Two, three, six, two, three, six, two, three. I uh, Yeah, that's a triple, isn't it? Two and three have to go in those cells. Uh, this is eight. This is going to be eight. And this is going to be seven. Okay, so that's the breakthrough I needed. Apologies for the bad color usage, but this is two, three, six. This is two, three, six. This is two, three. So eight, eight's there. Six is there. This is not eight. That is eight. Seven's forced to be there. Six. 
5. Uh, 1, 3 there resolves this to being a 2, that to being a 6. 7 makes this 5 and that 7. Because this is down to a 1, 3. So 1, 3, 9, you guessed it, that's another triple. Yeah, I think I have 11 different triples marked in this grid. Uh, 1, 3 comes up here. 5. Okay. Uh, delete those 4s. 2, 4 means none of these are 4. So this is a 1, 3, 8. You guessed it, I can mark that too. Not 8, not 1. Now, neither of these are 5 or 6. Two, three, four there, so yep, that's a hidden eight. This two, three, four, that's a triple, so eight, six, not six, not six, not eight. How many triples do I have marked in this grid? One. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. I have twelve triples in this grid. That is amazing. Okay, now have I hit an impact? An impasse? Probably. There's a hidden digit, there has to be. This could also be one erg. Seven's there, that's annoying. Nine's in two places across a region. Okay, seven's there. Which helps me in absolutely no way whatsoever. This is done, this is done. One, three, yeah, that's done. That, oh, duh. Two, three, that's a hidden pair. Hi, Jeeba. Come on, scan the board better. Two, three makes us a four. <sighs> Okay, so in fact, none of these are three. So you, I may as well, I mark, since I'm marking every blooming thing, I may as well mark this one too. Two, four. Okay, three, and uh, yep. Two, that's a three. Three in row two, so it's at one, three. These are five, seven, which makes this one. That's a two, that's a three, five, two, seven, five, eight, uh, two, four, six, five, six, eight, four. 
nine seven. Okay. Um, I'm looking at just the bottom third at this point. Column seven. That's a three. So one nine three sorts out one three. There we go. Uh, just under twenty minutes. Well, if I'd seen the two three pairs a lot sooner, I'd have been fine. But I'm happy with this time. I'm not exactly happy about the fact that if you take a look at the finished grid, there are a lot of triples here. I mean, I've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. 10, 11, 12, 13, 14 different triples. Well, once I do enough of these things, I will have seen the pattern well enough that I won't need this. But I like the visual aids for now. And thank you for joining me this afternoon.